What is up, folks? My name is Vladan Gribic, and as always, I will be your host for today's video. Today, we're going to be discussing one of the most confounding and confusing issues that the creators, new and old, have experienced through the history of the platform. The exact topic in mind is how long your videos should be. As far as the technology and the platform itself goes, YouTube has almost zero restrictions regarding the total duration of the video. I personally have seen videos of up to four or five hours that just discussed the philosophical implications of one video game, but on the other hand, there are loads and loads of videos that are about 10 seconds long. The only condition that you have to fulfill is that you need to verify your YouTube account via SMS and if you do not do that that still gives you plenty of time to make 15 minute videos that can satisfy most viewers. Well, this is the main topic of the video and this is something that we are going to go in depth with. The time and duration of your video depends on a lot of factors. The first and the most important factor is how exactly you would like your video to be monetized. If your video is longer than eight minutes, you can put more ads, well, of course, correlating to the length of the video. As I've said, on one hand, you have videos that are longer and have more ads. On the other hand, one of the bigger benefits of shorter videos is that that keeps people more interested because it is something that they know they can watch in only a couple of minutes. These bite-sized videos may not have as many watch minutes, but they do have a better retention rate. For example, if you decide to review a new pair of sneakers, you could go two ways. You could make a 20 minute video describing the whole history of the shoe or how it came to be, but you could also make a more pinpoint and laser precision video that only shows you the shoe or shows the viewer the shoe and shows the quality, the build and your opinion of it. It's not completely wrong to go with the first idea but I think all of us can agree that the second and more focused type of video will gain you more eyes and more video watch time in total. The same goes for content that is longer by its very nature, such as podcasts, uh, interviews with celebrities, interviews with other persons of interest, and the like. Even popular channels such as Joe Rogan and H3H3 Productions have alternative channels where they post snippets of their interviews with guests and this way the viewer knows where to find the video he is interested in, knows where he can find the topic that is being covered and he doesn't have to wade through hours and hours of content just to find that one interesting part. Besides having more ads being available on uh, longer videos, there is something else that is uh, that I've briefly mentioned in the previous section, which is the retention rate. We will cover the retention rate in depth in a future video, but for now, it's important to say that uh, the larger portion of a video your viewers watch, the better it is for the algorithm. This saying is definitely true if the video is firstly long and secondly interesting to watch, but if it uh, fails on the second part, well, all of your effort was in vain. If your video is only a couple of minutes long but has a retention rate of about 70 to 80 percent, it is going to be much better for the algorithm than if your video was, let's say, 15 minutes long and only has a watch time of three minutes. The end goal of each video is in fact keeping the viewer watching your video for as long as possible. In addition, people who are able to make this kind of content 
usually do so by provoking some sort of reaction or causing an emotion in their viewers, which usually gets them a like and a comment. And these two things also contribute to your videos becoming more popular and recommended by the algorithm. So whether yours is long or short, it is for you to decide how you're going to use it. Thank you for watching today's Tube Secrets video. If you liked watching the video, make sure to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon down below. If you have any questions for us, make sure to write them in the comment sections below. And if you'd like to get a free review of your channel, go to our website and take the free channel review.